is just kind of pointing out an interesting phenomenon where you can buy similar pens from different companies that all have sort of a take on a common theme, which is that more affordable version of a full stainless steel pen, which is half plastic, half stainless. Also, you get a lighter pen, which some people like. It is always because of the placement of that stainless or that placement of that metal. It's going to be a little top heavy, which uh, some people like, some people don't like. I like the balance of a full stainless steel Parker Jotter more than I do the half and half one, but uh, it's still a very good pen. And I've spent, spent a lot of time using uh, this one in particular, but these jotters in all forms. So I think they're pretty cool. Obviously, the, uh, the king of the bunch is the first year jotter, which is hard to find, but uh, it is a still a kind of notable piece in pen history. And if you could track one of these down, it's a lot of fun.